This video will show you how to make a website using Weebly. First, go to Weebly.com. Then, click Try It Free. Type your full name, your email address, and the password. Then, click Sign Up Free. First, choose a theme. Click on Blog and select one of the themes from this page. When you've found the theme that you like, click on Choose. First, find the title of the home page and type the name of your business. Then, click to add a headline and type something about your business. To change the image on your home page, click Edit Image. Then click Change Image. Scroll through to find an image that works for your business. Click on the image, then click Select. Then click Save. You can save it to all pages or only the home page. I'm going to save it to all pages. To change the color of the font, highlight the text and select a new color. If you want to type something more about your business, you can click on the box and enter the text. To edit your About page, click on About. Add a headline. And then click on the space below to choose a layout. Select the layout that you like by clicking on it. If you like how it looks, click Keep. If you don't like the image, you can click the X to delete it. Delete the placeholder text and type the paragraph about your business. If you want to add an image or add more text boxes, you can select one from the left-hand menu. Click on the element that you want to add, then drag it to where you would like to place it on the page. For images, click on the box and type in the name of the image that you would like to find. Select Free Photos. Click on the image and you can resize it by dragging the corner up or down. Click anywhere on the page for the menu to disappear. When you are done working on your web page, click Publish. Select Use a subdomain of Weebly.com and type the name of your business. If it is available, it will have a green check mark and you can click Continue. If it is not available, you will need to rename the business. To see your website, click on the link. 
If you would like to continue editing your website, go back to the Other tab, close the pop-up window, and continue to edit on the page. To save changes, click Publish.